Tonight, authorities recovered the body of a woman and child on board a plane that crashed into the Gulf of Mexico shortly after taking off from Venice last night. And as 10 Tampa Bay's Miguel Octavio shares, the search for one more person resumes tomorrow. Crews are calling off their search for the night, but for now, authorities say the plan, as long as conditions allow, is to search for a third person, a man believed to be either the pilot or a passenger on that plane. It's been a rush to find the Piper Cherokee plane. Officials say it should have returned to St. Pete on Saturday night. The four seat aircraft last seen on radar at 1937 hours. But instead, they'd find it in the Gulf of Mexico a third of a mile away from the Venice airport. I saw from Marine Rescue. They're just giving GPS coordinates advising two miles offshore. Around 10 Sunday morning, the city of Venice says boaters would find the woman's body floating two and a half miles from Venice Beach. Authorities confirmed she was in the plane. And later in the afternoon, that's when the city says they found the body of a child who was a passenger. My gut sank, to be honest. Like it just, you know, it just hurts. People on the beach feeling for the loved ones of those involved in the crash. You want to be able to help somebody and you just, there's nothing you can immediately do. No word yet on the identities of the woman and the child found along with a man authorities say is still missing. But again, the city says for now, the search will resume as long as conditions allow. In Venice, Miguel Octavio, 10 Tampa Bay.